So this is where they told you you come? Yeah. And this is James Street, this is, is it? This is James Street now. This is where they're saying we come from the Casablanca and march down James Street. Should we go down there? Yeah, come on. Yes, show the people exactly what's what. During our little walk around Butte Town, it was amazing to see the respect and admiration people had for John Acty. We couldn't even film for at least five minutes without someone beeping the horn or giving him a shout out. <laughs> <laughs> well, go on. Huh? You okay? Is that me, right? yeah. You're a celebrity anyway. I see you on Wales Online all the time. <laughs> Crime watch. Huh? <laughs> Give me a shout. Give me a ring. All right then. Woo! Hiya! Woo! Hiya! You okay? Long time no see, yeah? All right, hello there, young lady. So this is where it happened, John? Yeah, this is the place, James Street, 7 James Street. Yeah. Your memories? This is it. Well, bad memories, really, you know, when you think of James Street, you know what they said we'd done, you know? Yeah, I, I, I think the maddest thing about it is, um, over, you know when they say over years, like, yeah. things become legendary, like, yeah. me, I, in my head, when I've heard this story so many times, yeah. it's like it could be believable that yeah. you did walk from the Casablanca yeah, and you, yeah, yeah. like, I'm putting you here as if you was involved here, but you was never here. Never, never here, never here, you know, that's what they wanted people to believe, you know, when they put it, we come from the Casablanca, you know, all right, we was all in the Casablanca. I don't know where we was all in there that night, but I'm just saying they wanted people to believe we was in the Casablanca and we all walked down here to kill Lynette White because she owed money for drugs and all this stupid. You know, it's because it's in this area, black area, you know, drugs, prostitution, people have it, people yeah. are believing it. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Thinking, well, yeah, yeah, but them guys don't hang around together. You know, it was a story what the police made up, you know, and got the girls to, um, tell the story for them because that's what they fed them. They done it, they done it, you say this, you say that. Yeah. And that's exactly what they done. What was this area like then? Oh, it was kind of roughage, you know what I mean, down here. Yeah, it was kind of rough down here. You know, you had a lot of prostitutes, a lot of sailors, a lot of ships coming in. And, you know, it's, you know. It was... So I'm assuming the docks were still there then? Oh, the dock, the ship, everything. You had all the old places around here, the North Star, Mel's Bar, um, other, other little stupid little shit all over places, you know what I mean? Yeah. So it was uh, it was busy down here. So was that building renowned of a place where like prostitutes? I never stayed? even didn't even know that actually until and um, until um they said after. But no I don't think it was a, a, a known place for prostitutes because you know if it was then the the people in the community would have known oh there's all prostitutes going in there. You know people are talking in your local community. But I never ever heard no one talking about there was prostitutes in here. Not that I, I cared anyway, because it makes no difference to me where they were. Yeah. It seems like further, the further you got Butte Street, yeah. it was a really tight knit community. Would you say down by here was more. Well, you know, back then it was. Undesirable? Yeah, well. Because you still got a community around here as well, That's you? right. This community was only just coming up then. Do you know what I mean? This is so, a newer building. Yeah, it's a newer building to up there. So up there, it's, it's more established as, you know, a. a a bigger community. You know, it's a community down here, but they only start, I think they only built these houses in the 80s anyway. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So, yeah. you know, it was kind of new. Yeah, yeah. It's crazy. It's, it's mm. sad. And, and for the people as well, like obviously you, who, who, uh, who don't know what happened that night in that building, John. Well, of course, yeah. Yes, guys. Yes, brother. Okay. Well, there you go. You know, people said they heard screams around here. Um, these girls said they, yo, brother. Yeah, it's you hear screams. They love you around here, don't they? They love you around here, don't they? Yeah. And, and, you know, so basically it was, you know, it was, you know, it was, it was a rough area down here. Do you know what I mean? It was rough, you know? It's, and that's how it was. Yeah. You know, everywhere it goes through that area, you know, until it's all cleaned up, until it's all, you know, done up nice. Yeah, yeah. Let's have a little look walk yeah. around here. Yeah. Show me what gap it was. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this, um, so they were the flats by there where they called them out then, was it? Yeah, that's, that's where they said um, uh, Lee Anvil Day and Angela So there was, there was prostitutes over there? Yeah, yeah, there was they in someone's everywhere. flats over there. Now they said uh, it was up in that flat it, up would, there. They have, would they have come through this door? Or? Yeah, yeah, they would have had to be through that door. Uh, you know, it's what the police told them to say. They, would, they run up the stairs, they push past me, push me out the way, 
yeah, you know, big guy. Uh, push past me, run in the room and seen this and seen that. They, ne they, they never seen nothing. No, you know, and with only... the cars, they're not hearing screams from over there. No, they done tests on Panorama I've and seen, all of yeah. them things. They never heard nothing. I think the, They weren't again... even there, so they couldn't have heard nothing. <laughs> yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. You know, they, the police threatened them so much, they even convinced the girls they was there. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? They had to do what the police told them. Did I, the only time I seen these people is when they come to court. Yeah. You know? It's mad. Life goes on. There's someone living in that There's flat someone right living now. in there now. Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah. It's, yeah. It's it, life goes on. Of course it do. But I don't, I don't feel um, any, 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 you know, like people say, oh, how do you feel when you walk past? I don't feel nothing because you was I never wasn't there. <laughs> yeah. Do you yeah. know what I'm saying? So, uh, I know, know it, takes, it must take a psychological yeah, toll. No, you, you think know? about it. You think um, when you pass, you think, God, they thought, you know, didn't think. Yeah. They put me in a flat there when I wasn't even there. Yeah. You know, so you do think of it like that. But as far as uh, feeling uh, bad, no, I wasn't there. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Do you get um, uh, any problem? Do you, do you feel, how do you feel when you walk first? I say, I got no problem. Because like I said, I wasn't there. I'd never been in there. And thank God I'd never been in there because if I would have been there, maybe my DNA might have been yeah. in there. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? And they would have said, well, you was there before, and now we got you. Do you know DNA. if any of the others have ever been in there? Nah, or? no, none of them have been in there. None of them. They would have said you had been in there. None of them have been in there. Do you know what I mean? Thank fuck they haven't been in there because if yeah, any of their yeah. DNA would have been in there, and they, they would have caught, have died, that would have been yeah. the end. Do you know what I mean? Even if they had a fingerprint in there, they would have said, well, they was in there. That's, they wouldn't have even looked for Kafor. Do you know what I mean? It's the only reason they look for Kafor is because police come down from Merseyside and said this case should be reopened again. Yeah, and yeah. that was the only reason they reopened it. There's one thing I want to say, which is, it's ironic in a way, how something in this community could be like racially aggravated and put on a, on a black community. Mm -hmm. and, and, and you know, the memories, the devastation, mm -hmm. the death of that building. And now look at the beautiful art they got. Yeah, embracing, on the side of it. Embracing that. Yeah, yeah. I think that's really ironic and yeah. Quite frankly, but it's a that, positive That thing. was the way of the police back then, you know? It was out of control. You know, they could do whatever they wanted. A few hundred yards opposite the murder scene is Cardiff Bay Police Station, where John Acty and the other four were arrested, interrogated, and eventually charged for the murder of Lynette White. <laughs>